I know what um father means in sign language. How? Wow. This means cat is by um sign, sign language. language. Cool. And how do you say father in Spanish? I don't know. What do you call my dad? Papi. Pap uh, yes, papi. Or padre. But you can say papi. How about, how do you say cat in Spanish? I don't know. Gat Gapi. Gapi. Gato. Gato. Good job. Okay, you guys. Hello. Welcome back to my channel. So right now, it is currently 3.29 p.m. And me and Jericho are going to be going to... Wait, Dad, Daddy, I'll show you something. Yeah, that sun is like... Y'all, yeah, look guys. at this. Look at this. If I take this out. Woo! Wee! I need to show you guys something. I love you. Thank you. Everybody's saying thank you right now, I'm sure. How do you know? Because I know how sweet they are. They're really nice. But, yeah, so right now, do you know where we're going, Jericho? Do you remember what I said? At the store. Yeah, we're going to the store, a.k.a. the commissary. Will you get married? <sighs> when we were in the house, Gio was like, I was asking them if they want anything from the commissary because I'm going to the commissary. And he's like, wait, you can still go to the commissary? And I'm like, uh, yeah, I'm technically still married. So um, I, I've gotten some questions. Um, by the way, I've spoken to him about all of that. But I've gotten some questions oh, about mom. that. About like if I still get benefits and stuff like that, or yeah, like I'm still Look how tall married. I am. I'm taller. Wow. <laughs> I'm gonna go now. <laughs> but yes, you know, fortunately we still can go on there for appointments and stuff like that. So yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna I'm go to the commissary. The meat is extremely cheap at the commissary, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. Oh my gosh. I'm taller. I gotta look for my uh card because i was looking for it the other the other day i'm taller Anyways. than you mommy you are yeah. wow you're a giant <laughs> you guys so right here i have like a crack which really sucks because whenever i'm recording you can see the crack um and they sealed it but like you can still see the crack and it re it's really annoying so i'm gonna try to like maybe yeah i'll probably see it still in the middle right here but yeah let me just re let me just keep driving <laughs> It's me and Pookie time. There's somebody coming out. Oh wow, they have reserved parking and pickup now at the commissary. They never used to have that. But we're here at Langley Air Force Base. And over there is the PX for those of you who are familiar with military bases. And then their commissary. Let's see what deals they have today. Oh wow, y'all, look at this. Russet potatoes, five pound bag, two for three dollars. Wow. That is pretty awesome. I think I'm gonna take some, actually. Jericho, oh wow. Two for one dollar. <laughs> Onions, I needed this. You said what? 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 Oh, you just do a box Okay, we just got out. I still need to get some eggs and red onions. Don't forget that, Kiara. Don't forget eggs and red onions. Y'all, I had to record this because we seriously do need to pray for America. So you guys, I'm currently watching Gilmore Girls, and I am folding uh, a ton of clothes. 
I honestly don't even know where the control is, so I'm just gonna come into the closet. My closet is something else. <laughs> I have so much stuff in here. A lot of the stuff that I have is like storage. Like in this apartment, I don't have a storage uh, room, and I had one in my last place, and so I have like my bike in here. Look at it, and then I have like so many comforters. But I can finally walk in here because I was like, you know what? It's smarter to just like stand up my bike because I had it here and I could not walk in here. But I'm about to film like a quick little Instagram video for this uh, company that sent me a tote bag. And y'all, the tote bag is humongo. Let me show y'all. I don't even know exactly how to show y'all how big this thing is. But look at this, y'all. Look at how huge that is. And literally, let's see if I can fit my vacuum right in here. Okay, that's like not a good uh okay my hamper this hamper is super broken i'm gonna throw it out but look at my hamper your regular like hamper from walmart y'all look at that almost the whole thing fits in there <laughs> super big so i'm gonna i don't know if i should take this and put the, like all of the kids clothes in here or what but yeah, this is the bag that the company wants me to, you know, take a picture with and just record me putting stuff in here. So, yeah, that's that. And usually before I go to New York, I don't really record myself like um, getting ready and stuff, but I had a hamper filled with clothes. So I, you know, folded some stuff. The stuff that doesn't look folded is just like sweaters that I'm going to take to New York because it is obviously cold over there. So <sighs> I'm just like trying to figure out what exactly to bring and then my brother should be coming here on monday so yeah i gotta look through all this stuff figure out what i should take for myself because you know if i have an opportunity opportunity to go to uh new york i'm gonna take it so yeah we're doing that and here in hampton the kids have the whole week off of school so instead of like thanksgiving break starting the day before things when does it start I think they like in regular like schools they come out literally Wednesday and then they have you know Thursday Friday off and then they go back on Monday but they literally have the whole week starting from this Monday coming up which is November 22nd until next Monday which is awesome which is awesome so let me go ahead and pack um, and figure out what I'm gonna take for the kids and all of that because you know like having younger kids you have to take more than one item of clothing at least that's what i do i like overpack but it's better to overpack than underpack uh so is that the word underpack but anyways uh let me go ahead and do that where is my control i just had it right here. what i think impressed my dad the most you eating a 24 hour steak pretty fun dinner though yeah it was Y'all, I have all of my kids' clothes over here from going out clothes to PJs, some pull-ups, my daughter's PJs, some boots, and also some shirts for Kalia and leggings for her underwear, socks, and I still have my clothes and they're all gonna fit in here. Like, look at how big this is. The next day. Hey everyone, it is currently 7.12 a.m. And I'm about to go pick up my little brother uh, because we're going to New York. And so, you know, he's coming with. So I have the kids in the back. I literally packed up everything last night. And now we're on the road. Well, not officially. I gotta pick up my brother first. I have a whole bunch of snacks. And um, I was, I wanted to leave a little earlier, but I just was like, girl, like, what's the rush? lay down because i woke up at six i was like girl lay down until your body just feels completely awake and <laughs> then i woke up like around officially like around 6 30 put everything in the car uh well the rest of the stuff because i put like most of the stuff last night and yeah now we're on the way over there i'm excited because while i drive i love to listen to the morbid podcast <laughs> love listening to it and i hope that this week in New York is not like hella 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 cold because I kind of want to like do stuff because usually I like I'm just stuck in my mom's house on purpose because I just honestly don't feel like going out just because of one New York traffic two the way New Yorkers drive three parking and then 
yeah mainly parking because parking be like crazy especially if I want to go to like Times Square or Hamama Hamama Okay, she said we just go there like two hours ago. She's trying to say that it's gonna be like hours to get there, but yeah, we're like you know to go by um, the Freedom Tower and stuff like that. Like a lot of people would take the train, but like I've just been like New York has been crazy, but I've been seeing like hella you know crazy videos of New York recently, and I'm just like I used to take the train and stuff, and even walking crazy. Hold on one second, Mama in crazy areas when i was younger but now i have kids i'm a mama bear so i'm like and then they're not obviously used to taking the train and stuff but i kind of just kind of want to i kind of want to do that because <laughs> kalia has never been on a train and jericho doesn't remember the last time he was on a train he was one so anyways right now i'm about to uh get my brother get gas and then get some starbucks so bye you guys i already got my starbucks we are about to for real get on the road right now so let's pray really quick god let us drive safe and sound let everybody who's driving with us drive safe and sound and get to where they're going let us get to mommy's house safely protect us and protect our families uh here in virginia in new york everywhere thank you so much for waking us up today and for letting us have the opportunity to go to new york and to see our family. Amen. 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 Jericho. I mean, Kalia. Say amen. amen. Gio, say amen. amen. Okay. Lego. I know it's nothing new, but it's so good to see you. You guys, we're at the border of Virginia. I'm about to stop at a Royal Farms. Thank you. Oh. Thank you, babe. You're welcome. I gotta use the bathroom. Just got the kids some Royal Farms chicken. Let me see the chicken, Gio. There's just some chicken tenders right there. I love chicken tenders. You do? And Jericho's over here eating his chicken tenders. Look at my chicken tenders. Wow, that's yummy. It looks like a moon though. It does look like a moon. And then over here, I just finished putting gas. I literally was like up to like this line right here. But I just filled it up since we were here anyways. And we're literally in Virginia. Like the, the Virginia sign is somewhere over there. And then we're gonna enter Maryland right now. We do this every day. And I'm still so amazed by you So hold me tight through the night mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's just us two
you guys i'm currently in front of the halal truck right here we always get this halal food whenever we come and we're finally in new york finally the kids are in the car over here y'all it's crazy how easy this ride has become for me because you know whenever i see it, it's like six hours and 30 minutes i'm like oh that's a breeze anything over that i'm like oh dreading it but look at this new york city halal food yum you guys it's crazy because i remember walking these streets a long time ago before jericho was born um walking these streets at night walking these streets early in the morning um going to work coming home tired from work coming out of the, this train station right here actually um like freaking jumping over snow because there was a whole bunch of snow um and i'm just extremely grateful that you know with the job that i do have even though there's times where it's not my favorite just because what job is you know but when i come to new york especially and i think about moments like that i'm just like come back to life and i'm like yo i'm really extremely grateful honestly to like have this as my job you know where i can just pick up and leave whenever i want to and you know i feel like that's why i feel really connected to new york because it just brings me back to how i used to live back in the day um and now like I, I never in a million years would have thought that this would be my job when i lived here you know i used to love recording and stuff but youtube wasn't a thing back back then anyways and i never thought that they would be something like youtube but yeah i'm happy that we're here um i actually have to somebody's actually looking at me thinking that i'm weird probably thinking because i have the camera prop like right here <laughs> she probably thinks i'm like literally talking to the wall right here but um yeah i don't even know what the hell i was saying but oh i have to take some pictures uh for instagram with this bag that a company sent me so i like keep trying to remind myself that because my deadline is monday so yeah anyways <sighs> new york is my home i used to actually take this bus not at this specific spot but yeah I used to take this bus all the time hi hi jill coming over here with the wagon because look at all the stuff that's inside of my car <laughs> mama nice. yay nice. who are we gonna see mama who are we gonna see mama <laughs> mama Mama with her speaker. Jericho went to go use the bathroom. You gotta pee too. So did you pee on the pull up? No. No? Okay, let's go do pee pee. Hurry. Let's go. <laughs> Yummy. Look at this food. Jomers. What is that, Kalia? Hello food. Hello <laughs> food. You guys are doing your papa. Yeah. Hold up. Don't Can close you your eyes. Oh, oh, it's still there. Oh, it's still there. <laughs> stop blinking. Jericho, stop blinking. Okay, there you go. I got it. What? It was like a little white thing. Eat, Papa. Get it. Get it. <laughs> this is Carlos. This is her brother. I am so tired, bro. It's 4.39. We're listening to music. Hey, get it, Jericho. Get it, Jericho. Go, Kali. Go, Kali. Go, Kali. 
You guys, so it's currently 8.28 p.m. What in the hell is on my sweater? Don't mind that, y'all. Today is November 20th. We're at my mom's house, as you guys saw. And my mom right now is in the bathroom taking out her rolos, which is like, you know, the little roller thingies that you have in your hair. Um, I just want to show you how freaking long her hair is. Like, y'all, her hair is so damn long. And it's crazy because she takes a college. You guys know I've been telling y'all about the college that she takes. I'm not even sponsored by them, but like, bruh. Collagen is the wave, especially the one that she's taking because her hair is long as hell I'm gonna try to find a picture of her hair like like when she lost her curls and I'll post it here I've done that before but I'm gonna do it again because she showed me her hair on FaceTime the other day And I was like what the hell? Let me show you Wow, it's a mamacita, mamasota Look at this one You love mama's hair? She went into the bathroom yeah, she was like, Mama, your hair is so beautiful. Yes. You know, she told me just now, Mama, you're so pretty. Come on, for the money, the beautiful. What do you say? Like? Pretty. pretty. Wow, you're so pretty, Mama. You're so pretty, too. I love your I, hair. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you jealous? Let me get a kiss. No. Yes, you are. Yes, you. You told me that you're a jealous person. Anyways, y'all, I gotta start drinking that collagen because I have it in the house, but I don't drink it every day. She puts it in her coffee every morning. Um, I'll link it down below for anybody who's interested in that because y'all, I think mommy can the dijo they say collagen. Oh, Jill's dad told her about it because I guess he has like some friends that also take it and their hair is lush. Jer what's the word luscious i was gonna say luxurious luscious the curls are are back like my mom's curls right now she's her hair is blow-dried but her curls like when she has curls they're back because before they were all stringy and stuff but anyways i'm gonna stop blabbing i am tired i cannot wait to go to sleep somebody actually just hit me up and was like oh um can you please uh let me know what your honest review for the lull mattress is uh after i posted an honest review and i totally get it because you know there's people who like do sponsorships i guess only for the money and don't get me wrong money is great but like i honestly do not like show you guys anything if i don't really like it i've literally had the low bed uh, the queen size bed for about three years since i moved to virginia and then um i got an amazing opportunity to get another bed and upgrade so i got the king size bed and y'all mommy que yo te dije de mi cama cuando yo llegué no but i was like ay mi cama i'm gonna miss it yeah i was like i'm gonna miss my bed bro like i have been sleeping so good in that bed the pillows especially oh my gosh they're so freaking good i'm gonna have a link down below for you guys this part of the vlog is not sponsored like the other video that y'all saw it was sponsored but this part not sponsored but i'm literally telling y'all like i have a link down below and they have a special going on right now for 300 dollars off which is awesome but uh, y'all and then on top of it having like a king size bed and having all that space to myself even though i don't use all that space but i have the option to use that whole space and then the pillows i cannot stress it enough because i usually like in the middle of the night i'm always like folding my pillows like my old ones or i just like really wouldn't have a good night's sleep because of the damn pillows but my pillows have happened anyways i'm gonna end the vlog here thank you guys so much for watching uh y'all i've been trying to think about i was thinking about taking the ferry if you, any of you guys in new, that live in new york have taken the ferry um like to wall street or like any ferry in general let me know how it is because i kind of want to take it even though it's a little chilly outside but i want to take it and i want to record it because whenever i come to new york i literally i don't really do nothing so anyways i'm gonna stop blabbing love you guys stay safe try best to be better every single day and you guys will see me later peace out